So I was raised on my grandmother's stories by the fire in the village. Every evening, um, the setup would always be that TV's there, but um, it's not an all-night luxury. So you would switch on the TV using a generator and watch whatever program that you wanted to watch the popular one for the day and switch off. And then you left with just grandmother and her storytelling. My grandmother could weave a story out of nothing. She would tell the most beautiful stories and really paint pictures in my head that had all of us still wanting her to tell even more stories. And, and she had this taboo thing where she would never tell you a story during the day. And we didn't even understand what it was about. But I fell in love with the art form of telling stories and listening to stories. So as a consumer of film, I love a good story. But as a storyteller on film, um, I'm influenced still by the manner in which uh, Makuru told her stories. I started to fall in love with the fact that a film camera allows me to be me as an actor. It allows me to bring in all the colors. The things I was talking about with grandma storytelling, you can basically bring all the various colors of emotions into one frame and get away with it without even saying a single word of dialogue. And this is why I love film so much. And when an African story is told right, you probably don't even need to say too much.